Earthcubs, learn the world! Hi there Earthcubs! Get ready to dive into a splash-tastic adventure with me, Nigel the Nervous Narwhal! I'm here to tell you all about the coolest thing ever! Water! That clear, wet stuff that comes out of the tap and makes puddle jumping so much fun? Water is w w w w w w wicked But guess what? Water is not just good for quenching your thirst or for swimming. Water is the VIP, very important person, for all living things on the planet. Ooh, From the uh, tallest trees in the forest to the wildest animals in the jungle. And even the tiniest plants in your backyard. Hello. They all need water to live their best lives. It all starts when water from oceans, rivers and lakes gets heated up by the sun and turns into vapour which rises up into the sky. The vapour cools down and turns back into tiny water droplets forming clouds in the sky. When the clouds get heavy they release the water droplets which fall back to the ground where it seeps into the soil, fills up rivers and lakes and even travels deep into underground reservoirs, replenishing water sources for humans, animals and plants all over the world. Yippee! We call this the water cycle. But how do trees and plants get the water they need? Water is like a superhero of nature, <laughs> keeping everything green, growing and thriving. Imagine you're a giraffe munching on leaves way up high. You need water to slurp up those tasty treats. Or maybe you're a clever chameleon, changing colours to blend in. Water helps you stay hydrated and fabulous. And even the buzziest bees buzzing around flowers need water to make that sweet honey magic happen. Plants and trees soak up water from the ground with their roots to grow and stay strong. Without water, they'd be like a deflated balloon at the end of a birthday party. So, whether you're a tree-hugging koala, a turbocharged cheetah, a flower-loving butterfly, a trendy tree or a funky flower, we are all Team Water! Fact time! Water has been around for millions of years! The very water you drink today may have been drunk by dinosaurs! I might prefer a nice cup of tea, but I'm not going to argue with a T-Rex. He's got bigger teeth than me. Wow. The problem is the world is changing. The way we live, what we eat and how things are made all use a lot of water. Water is essential to all life on Earth, not just humans and us animals. Trees need water and water needs trees in return. Let's head off to Brazil and meet Antonio the Anteater and he can show us how important water is in the Amazon rainforest. Uh, bon dia Earthcubs, my name is Antonio the Anteater and welcome to my home, the beautiful, the amazing Amazon rainforest in Brazil. I will be your tour guide, so let's look at how important water is to this place. After all, it isn't called the rainforest for nothing. P.S. Please ignore the parrots, they can be incredibly rude and judgmental, especially when it comes to fashion. Parrot interlude! Ah, ooh, ah. What is orange and sounds like a parrot? A carrot! Ah. Water is a huge part of life here in the rainforest. Let's check some stuff out. Trees. There are over 16,000 different species of trees here in the rainforest and they all get pretty thirsty. Water travels from the soil, through their roots, into their trunks, all the way to the leaves, helping them stay strong and healthy, which keeps us healthy too. Bulls and insects. Okay, so most animals and insects here are my friends, and we all need water. From butterflies, to bees, to snakes, to iguanas, 
We all need water to keep the trees healthy and so we have enough to drink. And it's not just animals up in the trees that need water. There are piranhas and dolphins and so much more. Rivers and lakes. The Amazon River flows through the rainforest. It is 4,000 miles long. Wow! It also pumps over 200,000 liters of fresh water into the ocean every second. I mean, really think about that next time you have a glass of water in your hands. Mm. The water here is connected to water all over the world. Water really makes the rainforest work. Without it, we would have no trees, no animals, and no fun. So, look after water where you live as the whole world is connected. See you guys soon. Bom dia. <laughs> ba -ba -ba brilliant. The rainforest is amazing and has so much life. All life on Earth needs water. We can all take actions to be better with water. Making changes at home can help the whole world. Let's look at some cool things you guys can do to help out and care for water. No water goes to waste. If you haven't finished a drink or have any leftover water, use it for something else. Water the plants, clean the car, or put it outside for animals to drink. Less waste means more awesome. River respect! When plastic and waste end up in the water, they harm animals and plants and pollute their homes. Creatures might accidentally eat the plastic, get tangled up in it, or suffer from the dirty water. Sharing is caring! Tell your friends and family about the importance of saving water. The more people that know, the more water we all save. And the planet loves that! Right, I'm off to play with my pet ice cube now. His name is Derek and he is so cool. Remember Earth Cubs, water is wonderful. So looking after it means you're helping all over the world. P.S. Why not check your freezer and see if you've got a pet ice cube? Cubs, learn the world! Like, subscribe, hit the bell!